Good morning, everybody. My name is Nguyễn Hoài Nam, a resident doctor of 43 class at Hanoi Medical University, majoring internal medicine. I am stay here to present my study, evaluated sensitivity and specificity of Edward Slipinic scale and Vietnamese topang on patients with chronic obstructive pulmonary disease. My presentation include three parts. The part one, introduction. COPD comorbidities such as obstructive sleep apnea, or OSA, contribute greatly to this high COPD mortality. Coexistence of COPD and OSA causes more severe nocturnal hypersomia than either disease alone. You can see in a patient with OSA COPD overlap syndrome have a reduced of sleep quality, night oxygen saturation, and gangsular index, and increases at hypothermia, hypercapnia, pulmonary arterial pressure, leads to number of hospitalized COPD exacerbations and COPD mortality higher than COPD alone. As well as we know, the gold standard of for diagnosis OSA is polysonography research or polygraphy research, but it is expensive, so no anyone can be helped. In clinical, have a, some predict predictor for screening OSA. It can be backlink questionnaire, sleep apnea clinical score, stop bank, upward sleeping needs care. In, 19, in, 19, in 2019, Stop Bank Questionnaire Vietnamese version was published by Zhuang Zhuihua. And in this study, we just focus on Vietnamese questionnaire and Apple Sleepiness Care. From the internal classification of sleep disorder, third edition, published by American Academy of Sleep Medicines in 2014 have a three criteria for diagnosis OSA. The following A, B, or C. Uh, OSA was diagnosed if A and B are meet or only C criteria. It just results on, it just by on result of polysomnography. And in this study, we diagnose a patient with COPD only uh, just by on C criteria, when the I, apnea hyponia in takes by or more than 15 events per hour. Uh, our, our study was, con was carried, out, carried out as by my hospital from November 2019 to September 2020 with 46 patients. Patients were hospitalized for measurement polygraphy. We included in the study all patients who meet the following conditions. COPD diagnosis confirmed in back my hospital by GON 2019. The patient agreed to participate in research exclusion criteria, have a respiratory comorbidities like asthma or bronchiitis, present with mental confusion, with role prior agreement to participate in research our study is a decorative cross-sectional study analysis of data by SPSS 20.0 software. In this study, we use cd like polygraphy. You can see, you can see results based on signal of five channel, the nasal, fluid nasal channel, the move. A thoracic movement, abdomen movement, uh, sound capture, and oxygen sensor. Our data of polysomnography was connected with a computer have a cd like software. Research ethic. All patients in research were explained purpose of study and agreed to voluntarily participate in the study. All information about the object of study is confidential 
and only for research purpose, respect sympathy and share with patient. We have some results. The, the most patient with COPD in our study were elderly men and have a 17 patient with diagnosis with OSA account for 37% and have a seven patient with severe uh, obstructive sleep apnea with apnea hyponia index by or more than 30. The most patient in study were symptomatic group uh, gone B and D accounting for 80%. The Edward Sleepiness Care and Vietnamese Topang correlators with OSA outcome in COPD populations was statistically significant with P value less than 0 0.05. And then we draw the rope cover of Edward Sleepiness Care and Vietnamese Topang. And we've, we found that with Edward Sleepiness Care, a real undercover is by uh, 0 0.89. Uh, that's higher than an, a real undercover of study by Costa Farica in 20, 2015. By uh, a real undercover just by 0 0.689, which Edward Sleepiness Care was published in 1920 by Dr. John Murray. It has, it has been translated into many languages and is one of the most common predictors for screening OSA. Uh, and in this research, we found that Edward Sleepiness Care is a good predictor for screening OSA in clinical. With Vietnamese Topang, sorry, with Vietnamese Topang, the area undercover by 0 0.81, and it's similar with Edward Sleepiness Care, it's a good predictor for screening or at a in clinical. <coughs> at optimal cut point, we found that stopbound Vietnamese version have an optimal cut point by six. At this point, the sensitivity by 88.9% and specificity by 75%. With Apple Sleepiness Care, the optimal cut point by 10, the sensitivity is 100% and specificity by 71.9%. This is my presentation. Thank you for the attention. <laughs> okay, thanks so much.